I love it. I, I was torn between this and <laughs> the one with all the skulls on it, which I did like, right? But I just couldn't pass up the pumpkin. Like, I honestly, I just couldn't do it. I, re I recolored it a bit. So the pumpkin was black. But it's hilarious. I couldn't help myself. <laughs> it was so ridiculous looking. So we, this morning, we moved to Brisbane Wildlands and we cleared almost the whole area. We only have two points of interest and one quest, which are both in this area. Um, then we can basically continue our main story tonight because it takes place in, in this area. So now that we've completed all this, we can freely move around and do the main story in it. So I, I was quite productive this morning. We got quite a lot done. Uh, but yeah. There's a point of interest there and there is one more. Uh, oh yeah, we saw this time trial thing. I don't know what that is. I do have one more that I've missed though. Which I'm kind of confused about. I don't know where that would be. Eleven years? Damn. You've been playing this for too long. Right, we'll do this quest here. We'll get this and then I guess I'll worry about the last one. Maybe when we start doing the main story I'll come across it. something right so revive and escort allies to the southern spy camp slay hostile and destroy enemy equipment oh You're starting Akatar. Oh my god. I'm actually so excited. It's making me want to reread it with you. Funnily enough, I've not been wanting to read, but I started listening to um uh, Fangirl again, which is just like a super easy contemporary, but it's like a it's like a kind of comfort listen to me because I've I think I've read it twice before. So I've just got that on Audible playing while I do things because I, I just find it easy to... to listen to. I've never, funnily enough, I've never listened to this the audiobooks for Akatar. I do wonder what it's like. I forgot my blood fiend so. Oh, this one's kind of cute. See, it was Kindle I read all of them on. <laughs> Until the last one. Um.
but I've read them on Kindle twice. But yeah, I'm tempted to tempted to listen to them on audio audiobook. Do you have all of them on Audible? I've never even looked to see if they're on script. I don't think they're on script. You've got the first one so far. Right, okay. You're smart. You just buy them. You don't just buy them all, right? Yeah. You don't really get a lot of Sarah J Mass on script. Do you see me? Yeah. <laughs> Maximum pain. <laughs> wait, all of them are there? Oh wait, are they in English though? Actually? Because I remember I thought Throwing a Glass series were on there and they weren't in English. In English? Okay. I might I might re-listen to them with you. <laughs> you need to keep me updated on what you think of everybody as you go through. Don't don't leave me hanging, please, because it'll be killing me. Oh wait, I've got an unexplored area. What's this? Wait, what's this? Oh, that takes me to the silver waste. No, alright, I need to go here then. This is the bit I haven't explored. This must have the last uh, point of interest. Oh no, wait. No, yeah, this is different. Maybe in here? This, this doesn't go through. Wait, oh no, that takes you through there. That's different. Well, let's go here and see if I can get in. Oh, it's contested, so you can't fast travel to it, you motherfucker. Right, let's go. Oh shit, no! Motherfucker. I 
I'm like hobbling away here. Apparently I took part in an event. <laughs> What is this thing? Oh, you get stuff. Complete a lap as quickly as possible. Roller beetle time trial. Wait, what? I don't understand. What do you do? I need the mount first? Oh man. Oh wait, is it? No, this is the thingy, right? No, wait, I'm, I'm confused. Do you need the actual mount for it? You can't, you... can rent one. I, I thought that, but yeah, I don't know. I'm going to work my way back. I think this takes me back again. Oh, this is like miles away. Fuck this. That's a checkpoint. Right, hold on. Let me go. Oh, I can't. Fuck. I'm just going to go back. Hey, Commander Kill. Yeah, it's good. I am enjoying it, although I have no idea what I'm doing most of the time. But other than that, it's fine. Right, there's an area up here I have not yet went to by the looks of this. I'm dying here! I'm dying! Oh, listen, I already saved Jeez, I'm not doing it again. Yeah, I mean, it's the same in most MMOs, to be fair. Hmm. Yeah, it doesn't seem to be an option to, like... Be sound. No. No, doesn't seem to be. So, no. hello. Come, good soldier man. Say, charger man, watch boats. Peasanters, they steers peasanter boats. Puzzler. <laughs> Don't know. What's what's a guild puzzle? Hmm.
A guild officer needs to activate this mission for you before you can begin. Oh. Hilarious. Like, what is it I've not... How do I get in here? Move up here? Is this it? Oh wait, this is... I think this is... No. This is a dead end. Hmm. How the hell... How do I explore this area then? I can't see a way in. Box. Hmm. This lab area seems to be closed. Unless it's a part of the main quest, maybe. That's possible. Right, I'm going to do start my main story and see if it it gets me to the last point of interest. Sometimes it does. Oh, you can only access it. So I can't complete this part of the map. Well, that's rough. Hey, I'll just do my main story then, because otherwise this area is complete. So. Where are we going, sir? What is our uh, have you seen an Azura named Mink? Yeah, I would th I would have thought so that you wouldn't need a guild just to do a map completion. You have my attention. Let's go. No, I was going to say you must maybe the, maybe the story takes me there, or maybe there's another way. I don't know. We'll, we'll see. sell those golems they're defective and dangerous you were supposed to come alone mink who's this and what was that about my merchant why are you in two belts defective? Ugh, pay them no mind mr velen those are rivals of mine looking to uh, derail our transaction just give me a moment what are you doing here, and why are you trying to ruin my deal? What are you doing here? I improved on your design. <laughs> is it though? Quiet, I don't even like one bell. is like a bomb waiting to go off. Didn't you hear about the people it already killed? Even if I believed you, progress demands sacrifice. Step aside. I've got a demonstration to make, and I'm not letting you spoil it. Okay, Savant, stand by. This demonstration of his could get us all killed. You watch the golem, I'll watch that shady buka Mink's dealing with. Now, okay. behold, Mr. Velen, as my golem loads up your cart with... Uh, what's in these casks again? They're full oh. of... Wine. Nothing Fuck. but fine wine from Beetleton. Very he will. Valet, Five belts, Mr. though, Velen's then you're a proper adventure. <laughs> oh, that's what I've been missing. Baggage handling sequence activated. Should have known. Handling baggage. Handling bag bagging. Handle haggling. Handle bag gaba ha big haggle. My goods. My cart full. What have you done, Mink? That's some powerful stuff you've got there, Mr. Velen. I didn't know Beetleton made weapons grade wine. Cute. Mink, as far as I'm concerned, you, your friends, and this deal are a total loss. Boys? Time to cut some losses. Put these bunny-eared freaks in the ground. Wow, rude, Don't man. Are you calling a bunny-eared so freak? Never waste a course. Damn right. Quick now, protect me and kill them. I was like, where are they? Give it your all. They're going to kill me. Oh. 
Thank you very much for the fall. Can't take out a few measly You're dead. Keep your eyes open and focus on your enemies. Oh, oh. That's how amazing I am. Kill them. Kill them or I'll be next. And then it's your turn. Let's do this. Nobody attacks me. Nice. Yeah. Thanks for saving my life. Who'd have guessed that a murderous smuggler like Velen would prominently across your chest? Everybody but you. Besides, with all the extra power cells you crammed in that goblin, you're lucky it didn't explode in your face. Wait. What the hell? You did a resub this morning, Favors? Were we wrong? Was Keppa the one we wanted? Is this a non-gifted sub? What? Keppa. Huh. Golems. Thank you very much. Great junk glued together with mucilage. They fall apart after two steps. Minx a brainless toad, but he does. That was like six months of gift sub you had there. Thank you very much for continuing it manually. For now, let me run a few tests back at my lab. Meet me there, and we can explore my new theory. You're visiting America later this year, Moz. That's cool in September. Uh, 26th of September or something, Will. End of September, I think, Starfield is. Nice. Oh, I know of a good use for this. Oh, I got basic salvage kits. Nice. A grey die. Oh, how exciting! I also forgot to eat again. Cause I am smart. Oh, it's metal scrap. Okay. Where are we heading? Oh, here. Oh, I September. Oh, wait, the 6th of September? I'm so not on top of when that's due to come out at all. Oh, no, it's not this way. Fuck my life. I just... It's over in a... Uh, what's it called, isn't it? Yeah. God damn it. Fucking do that every time. A yearly by yearly thing. That would be amazing. of his idiocy, then the culprit has to be higher. I've built this golem to highest specs. Once I activate it, we should see results. Stand by. Good morning, mistress. How may I serve her kill you today? Kill, kill, kill. Okay, there's our proof. 
Hmm. Deactivating the golem may require force. Time to attack. I've got some aggression Suspended to work out. Service protocols. Effects protocols. I did I just hit myself with that? that Haya swapped in must contain a hidden exploit to drive the golems to murder. So we're going up against a counselor? No mean task, but I'm ready. I don't care how high up she is. She can't do this to us. No sarcasm this time. Haya's not just smearing snaps Enjoy her well. or mine. She's killing people and framing us for it. We have to take her down in front of the entire council. Let me find I told you it was the council member. I council knew members. she was sus because we didn't suspect her at all for like no reason. Fucking called it. Is everybody going to be playing Starfield on Royce? I don't know what to do about Starfield. If I'm honest. Most likely no. Haya, we know you're the one who turned the valet golem into an anti-personnel device. We've got all the proof we need, and we're going to expose your machinations to the entire council. Machinations? Proof? Great word. You mean those blueprints I gave you? The ones my underlings are retrieving from your lab at this very moment? You're not in my league, dearies. And after my modified valets are finished with my fellow counselors, no one else will be <laughs> either. You'll get the blame, of course. Nothing personal. This is merely how top-level council politics play out. If it helps, I'd be happy to feign remorse. Let's go, Savant. If the council gets wiped out by your golems, the peacemakers will fry us on sight. We'll have to catch up with Haya later. Good luck, my darlings. Try not to die too painfully. Damn. I just hope those oaths on the council are grateful. Yeah, I don't think they're going to be. But sure. Hey, Mama, how you doing? Stop them before they bottle again. These valet golems are remarkably useful. Wherever did they originate from? They were a gift mm. from an anonymous donor. Mm. Mere toys, of course. Oh, but it's nice to be appreciated. Masters, I shall now perform a deep cranial massage with my fists. <laughs> By my ears, take cover. <laughs> ah, deep cranial massage with my fists. Love it. Oh, this one's kind of cute. Whoa. Ow. Explode, my minions! Explode! 
Jesus. <laughs> Their dialogue is hilarious. Would you like a haircut? <laughs> <laughs> for once, I'm uh, glad to see Tug, you. thank you for the reads. Is that the snuff Milkman, art? everybody. What is the meaning of this? Those valet golems were based on my designs. <laughs> Counselor Haya tampered with them and said to kill as much of the council as possible. What is that? I can vouch for this. Haya is making a power play. We don't have hard evidence, but... Say no more. Bold that was great. moves are Haya's style, and she never leaves evidence that can be traced back to her. Leave Haya to us. Welcome, we everybody. I hope you her. enjoyed the Stardew stream. She may well receive a lethal gift of her own someday soon. In the meantime, you have our thanks. We're just saving well, the world, it's not a you know. Victory, it's but fine. We did save the Arcane Council thank you for the resub as well. Snaff's reputation. Oh, of I'm course it is. It's a rat, isn't it? Or a mouse I or something. Yeah. Again. Should I know it was Sarhana's emote? Savant. Sarcasm aside, you can count on me to live up to his example. Uh, I'm just doing some main story. I just completed the area that we're in, so I'm doing a bit of main story. But, uh, oh, thanks for giving Tug a shout out. If anyone is uh, new in here, I don't know if anyone is new from Tug's channel. I, I you know, mean Tug. <laughs> I think most of our viewers know each other, but I'm a variety streamer and I'm currently playing the Guild Wars 2 because um, I'm kind of waiting to play my next big story game, which I think is going to be Cyberpunk when the new update and DLC drops. So I'm just kind of passing time with other games until then. Uh, I am also doing a Stardew playthrough where I'm getting as many of the achievements as I can and uh, yeah but mostly playing this. I've also back playing Heroes of the Storm but I do that on my second channel because <laughs> this channel has uh, you know seen enough of Heroes of the Storm. No one needs that over here. Tug, if anyone in here doesn't know, is also a variety streamer. It was doing a summer of Stardew, but it's coming to the end of that and is going to be playing Day of the Diver coming up. So definitely go give a follow because that game is amazing. <sighs> Welcome in everyone from the raid. In two days, I've uh, made the dagger and the scepter. Oh, you'll be happy to know, Tug, that Link went for his checkup post-operation and he is doing great. They thought he had been the girl uh, mistook that he had only been out of the operation for three days. She thought it had been a week because of how fast he is healing. Which is funny because we call Link Wolverine because he always heals insanely fast. Wait, can I not? Oh no, I can't. Oh, I can do the scrap. Uh, I don't think I can do any of them with these. Oh no, I didn't want to do that. I think I just destroy these. Sell that. Yeah, it's funny though because you know what is what is causing him a problem? He has quite bad shaving rash <laughs> on his two butts, on his two butt cheeks. <laughs> like the 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 scar and the stitches like look amazing. Not a mark, no redness, and then his two butt cheeks are red and itchy and annoying him. Poor boy. <laughs> It has sensitive skin. I need to put like some sort of like E45 cream on it or something to help him help a boy out. He might start being a variety streamer again soon. I don't believe it. Tug's always been a variety streamer. And I say this because I'm a variety streamer. No, I actually feel like probably I, I think it 
okay, so my justification for vari being variety is that I focus on a game until I am sick of it. And then I get a new game to focus on until I'm sick of it, and then a new game to focus on. I don't, I'm not one of these people that can have like a game on Monday, a game on Tuesday, a game on Saturday. I have to play a game. I think Tug's similar to that. Threatened to shave his ass again. <laughs> uh, to be fair, Link's the goodest boy ever. I think this is downstairs. Uh, do you want to see my, my Twitch drop outfit for my character that I picked? <laughs> there was so many to choose from and this is what I picked. It's ridiculous and so funny. A fishing stream <laughs> streamer for six months, yeah. Yeah. That is, this is what I look like on the inside. This is me under the skin. Uh, where are you? Are you down again? No problem. I was going to say have fun, but that doesn't sound like fun. So, you know. Endure it or something? Oh, here. Thank you. Intriguing stuff. Good, you got my letter. Gore's just about to start his presentation. This should be interesting. Indeed. Now, welcome, Professor Gore. The seventh law of Maginatics posits that magical energy cannot be destroyed. Today, I will prove that magic is a limited resource, like water or, or timber. Using my advanced equipment, I have detected significant drops in the world's ambient magic levels. This drop, I believe, is directly attributed to the return of the Elder Dragons. They consume magic at an alarming rate. If the dragons are not stopped soon, they will leech all of the magic from the world. Ah, bosh. Magic doesn't get consumed. It changes form and concentration, but it always returns. It's part of a closed system. I have proof. No. The data is... No. 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 I must have left them in my lab. Uh, please, excuse me while I fetch I can prove the problem exists, then we can focus on its solution. Professor Gore will return shortly. Until then, please welcome Sepha from the Phrenologist Group. Thank you for coming. I see a lot of overlap in Gore's theory and our shared goals. As do I. If Gore's research aligns with the Priories, we may be looking at a cultural revolution. Revolutions are won militarily, not academically. Still. Gore's theory could prove useful. I agree, but nothing can happen until Gore makes his case. Why don't we all settle in and listen? I like her. Oh, she's got my hair, but red. I was going to say, I like your hair, but it's my hair. Can I? You have something to Savant, allow me to present three of Ratasum's finest minds. Slep of the Vigil, Batanga of the Order of Whispers, and Crosso of the Durman Priory. I asked them here to listen to Professor Gore's speech, because they all have an interest in fighting the Elder Dragons. Elder Dragons sounds Please cool. To you, Savant. The Durman Priory is dedicated to research and exploration that will help us combat the Elder Dragons. As you can imagine... We've been watching Professor Gore's progress with keen interest. I'm glad to see you share that interest. We all share the Priory's interest, just not their methods. In the Order of Whispers, we specialize in covert activity, 
information, infiltration, and assassination. She's cool. I understand you're more of a doer than a researcher, so you'll appreciate this. If Gore's theory gives us a clear avenue of attack, we intend to use it. How clear does a target have to be for you sneaks? The dragons aren't exactly tiny, nor do they keep a low profile. The Vigil's army of dedicated fighters was founded to confront the dragons through force of arms. I'm here to see if Gore's work can help us do that. Pleased to meet you all. Professor Gore's theory is groundbreaking, and the implications are monumental. I'm interested to hear him finish his presentation. He should be back soon. Let's see if any of the other speakers have any insights for us while we wait. An exhaustive study of okay. physiognomy led me to derive what I call Cepha's constant. Multiplied by the mean ratio of body mass to brain uh -huh. size, it yields an important racial metric. Namely, said race's importance as a What's factor going on? in the eternal alchemy. Asura scored highest naturally. Then in descending order, we have Silvari, Char, Human, and Nord. Why did she run up there and talk to him? Your attention, please. I have just been informed that our colleague Gore will not be returning. The Arcane Eye reports that he was killed in a tragic lab accident while what? covering his notes. It is a terrible blow to science. We should all mourn one of Ratasum's finest minds. On that dolorous note, this seminar is hereby. Oh shit. Well, he's not coming back now. Excelsior. No. I want to confer with you. Freaking gore. Do you require my assistance? I'm confused. Why can't I? Oh, have I just to speak to each one? How interesting. Uh, is it only him that I'm speaking to? Happy aunt. Oh, wait. Uh... No, this is just about her. You? I am like a shadow. I am like a shadow. We. Certainly, Gail can avoid a war by blackmailing a general. That's what we do. Oh, now I can do you. We are the knife in the dark. No, not you. Oh, excuse me. There we go. I had to speak to them. Gore died. Just I had to speak to each to one, I think, before I could speak theory. to Zoya. Does that strike Zoya? anyone else as suspicious? Even dubious? It does. I'd like to inspect Gore's lab and review his documentation. Though if the arcane eyes involved, we may not get that chance. The Order of Whispers can help. The arcane eye serves the arcane council, right? They have to do what the council says. It's in their charter. We simply pay a visit to High Counselor Flax's lab, find the materials to make a convincing forgery, and walk right past the arcane eye. How unnecessarily complicated. Simpler to just outwit the sentries outside Gore's lab. The Arcane Eye can't match the Priory's brain power. I'll leave fact finding to the Priory and whispers. When you lot establish a clear objective, the vigil will be ready. Listen, Savant, okay. I'm pursuing a long term, big picture strategy here. So I want you to take charge. Choose the most viable plan and see it through. We need to know what Gore was going to show us. And if he was silenced, we need to know who did it and why. Good luck. Okay. Greetings and salutations. Outsmart and access the lab. Their detailed sec their security detail must have a form. We're the ones to identify it. 
Access Flax's office, forge the documents we then breeze past the sentries. Hmm. Alright, let's try this one. You've chosen wisely. I'll meet you outside Gore's lab. Yeah, I think we can outsmart them. Fuck them. We are smarter than everybody. <laughs> An eight slot invisible bag? Items in this bag will never appear in a sell to vendor list and will not move when inventory is sorted. Oh, I quite like that. Hmm. The only problem is it's only eight sort, right? So... I could put like my stuff in here that I want to keep. Uh, can I change the order of these? I can. Like my crafts work and like my key and stuff like that. Yeah, they won't. I just, I just, uh, do you know what it is? I just don't like them getting sorted. That's all, but uh, it doesn't actually matter that much, to be fair. I'll leave it just now. It's more the sorting that I like that it doesn't sort it. <laughs> uh, but I'll keep it for sure, just so it's in there. Uh, right, where are we heading? Uh, back upstairs. Oops. Yeah, it does not surprise me, no. Maybe we can tease a gap in their defenses out of the guards. Okay. Hi. What? What's going on here? We have an appointment with... There's nothing going on and nothing to see here, citizen. But we need to get inside. We're expected. My orders come from Agent Racked himself, and he says no one gets in without clearance from the Arcane Council. Move along. Empirically speaking, we're not getting in through the front door. The guards won't risk getting on Rack's bad side. He's a particularly nasty character. We need a better plan and fast. The Priory's reliquaries are full of magical items. If the dragons feed on magic, those reliquaries become prime targets. We could overpower the guards, grab what we need, and fight our way out. Too public. We don't want to alert the entire Arcane Eye and everyone else in the vicinity. We need to think our way in. Racked is meticulous and cautious. He would have sent hazmat suits in to analyze dangerous areas in the lab. Follow my lead. I've got an idea. Okay. You study astronomy? Because you're about to see stars! What the heck? Vision impaired. Oh, 
Aren't you feisty? Grab a hazmat suit. Once we're disguised, they won't look twice. I need to go in from the other side. I take it, yes. Coming in. Open the doors. <laughs> Look there. I believe the common parlance is a body bag. Look at this, Crasso. I love that it's I the suit. Poor devil, but it's <laughs> definitely not Gore. I concur. The arcane eye must have him socked away somewhere, and if Gore's not here, there's no need for us to linger. Agreed. But what do you think happened here? Does the Priory have any information or insight that could explain this? We have entire libraries full of information on the arcane eye, on Rakt, and on Gore's research, but this doesn't make any sense to me. Yet. Of course, we need to be alive and unincarcerated to learn more. With that in mind, let's make a graceful exit before Rack gets wise. Yeah, sounds good. Nobody's supposed to be on shift right now. Identify yourself. We're the special task detail. Our orders are to examine all the, um... You're not a member mm. of this crew. Who are you and what are you doing here? We're just, uh, oh, never mind. Time to fight! What? Intruders, shut down all hazmat suits. This area is compromised. No! Oh no. Freeze. Anybody moves, you all get lit. What's going on here? Who are you? We're Nothing. admirers of Gore's work. We came to pay our respects to his body. But as you can see, it's not here. I have no idea what you're talking about. There's nothing even remotely out of the ordinary here, except you. Since this is a secure area, and since you're not authorized hey, to be here, run, or I will exercise my right to use lethal force. Let's go, Crasso. I want to regroup with the others and find out what they and Zoja make of this. Carry on, Savant. Zoja, that's it. I was calling her Zoya. Zoya's the person in a... <laughs> What's it called? Shadow and Bone. <sighs> Elves. What, my, the characters, the race, or the uh, As Asura? How long have you I fought for years in this war. I know what it's like. Did you hear? I'm really interested to see where the story actually goes, like... Wait, where am I going? I take it I'm going down and inside here. I'm in the wrong place. Oh yeah, here we go. Like, once it moves on to like the main story that everyone gets access to. So Gore's death was a fraud. How does knowing that help us? The problem is still Elder Dragons. While you poke around in back alleys or libraries for information, the Vigil is out there fighting. 
And while you're fighting, Whispers is setting up the means to deliver a death blow. We appreciate the distraction you provide, but you don't really think you're going to overpower an Elder Dragon, do you? Swords alone won't get results. Neither will Intrigue. The Priory supports a more holistic approach. We intend to learn all we can about the dragons and their weaknesses before we strike. <laughs> okay. Rack's arcane eye agents were all over Gore's lab. They removed a body they claimed was Gore, but it wasn't. I suspect he's still alive. If he is, the arcane eye has him. They run a remote facility in a human village called Garenhof. It's isolated, remote, a perfect place to stash Gore. Finally, a concrete objective. Just say the word, and I'll have vigil soldiers standing by to storm Garenhof. No, Rakt is too good at this game for that to work. But I'm better. We can use Garenhof's low profile against him. I say we stage a demonstration and get ourselves arrested. Rakt will haul us in to avoid undue attention. Then we break out and bring Gore with us. Regrettably, I cannot participate. I must confer with my colleagues in the Priory, but I wish you luck. Let's regroup when the mission is complete. I want you to take it from here, Savant. I'm going with Crasso to help the Priory look into Gore's theory. We both need to make inroads with I want to do the one where we get arrested. That just sounds like work fun. <laughs> whichever one here you think will get the job done. I will. I'm as eager to figure this out as you are. And eventually, you'll need to share some details about this long-range plan of yours. Oh. Oh, okay. I keep pressing the wrong button. Fight what cannot be fought. Yeah, we're doing this one. Cool. Now, what's next? <clears throat> cool, cool. Yeah, we'll do that. We'll do the thing where we stage the protest thing, get arrested, and then bust out. Bust. I hope I'm going to be in some sort of disguise because it's definitely going to recognize me. Oh my god, look at this outfit! That's cool. I love it. Right, oh, that's nice as well. I like the colors of that. Uh, okay. That's fine. Oh no, that's not it. A privateer hat. Uh, I'm just going to use the last one of this. That one's close to me. Huh. Uh, I'm going through here, I guess. I haven't been to Lion's Arch in this uh, this character yet. says that uh, like stitches are looking like amazing but uh, he's, he's having some issues with a shaving rash on his bum. I've already seen this. Uh, so he says he'll need the cone on for a bit longer than usual because that will be really itchy. These two butt cheeks if you look at them are like quite red. It's sore looking yeah. <laughs> I was like he does have quite sensitive skin. <laughs> Uh, feel better though because she was telling me about her dog had the same operation and the absolute nightmare they had with the healing process. They would drag their bum along the ground and they had to go back in another operation to get it restitched and everything so they burst she it all open. No, he's not done any of that. Didn't do I know, but she says they were like, they managed to, they had a cone on her dog and a dog bodysuit and it was still getting to the bum through both of them. <laughs> It can lick through it though, because they just go through the fabric. It's not actually enough. I see you, I see you. I know. 
Hmm? Oh, sorry, it's out there because I was doing it, using it on her TV again. Such a baby. Tighten it up. Give this place a good tour. Right, okay, calm yourself. You look out. Give me an apple too. Yes. My kiss. <laughs> I know you've been getting ignored. Hmm? Been getting ignored lately. Hey, thief! Because of the sick boy. Right, okay, I guess I need to uh, clear this area. Oh no, I'm just going through another gate. Wise. Oh, little stinkers. Always get um always get frames at frame rate issues at this area. I wonder how many, like, you can't see a head in your story. Like, uh, you can't, I can't see, like, how much you've got ahead of you, which I don't know if I love that. Where the fuck is this? Is this taking me another portal? Well, no, maybe not. This is an actual place. This place is cool as fuck, look at that. Wait, like, see when you see it on the mini map? Look at the roof. The char are winning. Ebonhawk is losing. Is it, what's this? Why is there a little guy in a speedo? <laughs> what's going on here? <laughs> what? Wait, why is there two? <laughs> what is God, that's funny. <laughs> uh. I know we are going through another gate. Okay, I'm picking up some stuff on me. My lord. Was that f oh you've met him? Where is this? Oh wait, I'm just outside the city. Wait, where is this taking me? Oh god, I'm going away down here. Alright, I'm nowhere near that area. Cool. This is a whole new area that I'm going to. Okay. That's fine. Well, I guess we're exploring Queensdale. That's cool looking. The fields beyond Shamor are Kryta's breadbasket. 
Since the Centaur attack, citizens are trying to rebuild their lives. But it's tough with bandits and dangerous wildlife roaming the area. Don't wait for an invitation. Jump in and help them. This is a waypoint. Waypoints appear on your compass, which is in the lower right corner of your screen. You can also see them on the world map, which you can access by pressing M. Press M again to close the world map. To teleport to a waypoint, open your world map and click on the waypoint to which you want to travel. Is this guy talking to me about how to use waypoints and how to open a map? <laughs> what? I'm confused. Why are you telling me this now? I guess this is a low level area. That's hilarious. Um, okay. This area is pretty nice. Oh, this is the human starting zone. I see. That's funny as fuck. I was like, wait, why am I finding this out now? Wait, oh, is this not the way? Oh wait, maybe this is the way? We're not friends? What the fuck? Oh, hold on. Um... There's treasure near this location at Sanctum Harbor. Okay. Um... Wait, how do I... I think my name's just Dauntless. Oh wait, well, Daunt Death Whisper, I guess? Is my character name? Is that... Hello, can you find me via that? I don't actually know how to get into the social... ...menu. Oh. This is a shop, apparently. I've never been in here before. Oh yeah, I only have chemo on here. That's correct. Oh, I've got you here. Oh wait, I'm Dauntless GG apparently. I can just add you from here, right? That's weird. I wonder how I've got people in followers but not friends. I don't know. Maybe if these people will try to add me and then I've just not like accepted. I have no idea how that works. <laughs> <laughs> so people were sending me them and I wasn't accepting. <laughs> oh, that's hilarious. Why does that sound like something I would definitely do? <laughs> That's excellent.
Oh, hi. Ooh, this boy. Okay. There was another one along here. Oh, there's a Vesta here. Oh, up there. I've accepted everyone now. Most of those people probably don't even play this anymore. I don't know, I've just never like thought about adding people in Guild Wars 2. I don't know why. It never really entered my brain. <laughs> uh, right, straight across I guess. Squish spiders, drive bats. Okay. Most people don't realize trees are male and female. If you right click the loot hearts, the chests that show up on the right, you you open and dismiss them without opening the screen in the middle. Just say, oh right, if you right click them, cool, thank you. Oh, I just need to kill spiders. Okay. <laughs> okay. There's a waypoint here. Search bushes for lost moas, kill bandits, recover feet. More more suspicious bushes. This game loves a suspicious bush. Oh, 
actually was a lost one. No, I didn't mean to do that. happening oh my minions are killing people it's fine <laughs> you're kidding right you're kidding right hold on um that's point of interest but Die by tending corn, stomping where mounds, entertaining cattle. Entertaining cattle? Amazing. <laughs> what is this? Are you entertained? Are you not entertained? Are you not entertained? My god, the cow's got love hearts coming out of it. Amazing. It loves me. Good to be noticed. Oh, I've done that one already. Oh, I keep forgetting I can... Ah, uh, there's one down by the water, yeah. I think I guess we're going to be doing something with the traps. Check the traps. Break three eggs. I 
I just saw in the mouth of my blood minion and it's weird, my blood fiend, and it's freaky. Onwards. Yeah, the Guild Wars 2 wiki. Yeah, Kimo was saying his uh, original uh, character just got its 11th birthday gift. 11, 11 years. Like, that's insane. No wonder he's a wiki. Okay, yeah, just straight up. There's a couple of areas here. Oh wait, this is Fevers. Was this where you were the other day? This looks familiar. You got an 11 as well. You both played at launch, yeah. Oh, you were here at the time when you said it. You don't know anything, which is funny that you've played it that long, but you've not done the later expansions. I guess, like, I've played a lot of Elder Scrolls Online, not that much, Renoff, <laughs> and there's newer expansions I haven't played either. You were here? Yeah, I remember you running round here. I don't really know what this uh, event entails. Semper, good afternoon, how are you? Uh, wait, there's a thing in here. What's this? There's a point of interest in there. Oh no, I got it. Oh well. Uh, in this cavern as well, I guess? You hit level 80. Oh, whoops. Oh, that's fine. There's a scout over here. The city of Claypool is burdened with many of the same problems you see here at the trading post. Centaurs are near neighbors. Yeah, okay, it's thanks. It's difficult for Claypool to maintain a standing militia, being so far from Divinity's reach. I think my dog wants dinner. <laughs> Let me take a quick break. I'm going to change my coffee for a Dr. Pepper and feed the dogs their dinner. We helped out other noobs and did all the actual in-game content two years late. I mean, whatever part of the game you enjoy, you know what I mean? Yes, it is juice. <laughs> it's fizzy juice. Specifically, you would say fizzy juice, not just juice. <laughs> 